You still don't understand, do you? When I read a script the first time, I have a pretty clear vision of the thematics and the story. That's awesome. I really like the way that's flowing. I've known Paul for four years, and Paul has directed uh, five episodes of The Vampire Diaries beautifully. And I had the pleasure of directing him in a Originals crossover episode, and we were talking about directing. I talked to a bunch of people who had worked with him, and they were all highly complimentary of him. Can we do like a market? Can we do a market? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Paul knows this mythology because of, obviously, The Vampire Diaries. He's been through this kind of stuff before, and he understands that the vampires have certain powers, and the shadow hunters have certain abilities. That there are rules in place within this world that you have to follow. It worked! Having someone like him who's been an actor in this kind of a genre for so many years is extremely beneficial. He has this kind of insight and this instinct as to what works and what doesn't and what can be interesting and how to change things up a little bit and get us out of our regular rhythm. As an actor, whenever I am directing, it's funny, I do the opposite of what people would think I would do, which is get cerebral or analytical. I understand that acting is a very personal experience and I think that it's important for actors to bring their own intuitive and instinctive drive to a character. He gave us a little bit of freedom to uh, interact as we know each other. Trust me, I know the damage secrets can cause more than anyone. And was able to spot things that maybe weren't going well, and he, he spoke very clearly with us and gave very clear direction. I do like your idea of like, oh, dad, blah, 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 blah. It's important to trust actors, and I think I, I appreciate it when directors trust me, so I always try to trust actors. You always cared more about the mortal instruments than you did your own son. That's not true. I got to do some really interesting character work with Valentine and Sebastian, which is this really interesting father-son dynamic. I wanted you to be proud of me. Oh, I was so proud. I get to be inventive visually and create a world that is a big, iconic world in the book series. Welcome to Idris. And I think it's going to be a, a really great episode. It's cinematic, in my opinion, and I'm excited for fans to see what we've created.